Good morning, Moreland. Happy Tuesday, November 14th, 2023. It is a day three on the day cycle calendar. Happy Tuesday to you. Hope you had a great Monday yesterday. Great start to your week. It was really super nice out yesterday. Really nice fall-like day. Really got me in the mood for what's coming next week, which is Thanksgiving. So I hope you had a great start to your week and you are ready for an awesome day today. Continue to follow those expectations. Continue to put forth your best effort. Continue to practice those expectations in the hallway. I really see first and second grade, even kindergarten, walking in the hall with those expectations. First, kindergarten, first and second grade is giving the intermediate grades are run for their money. So if I had to choose a grade level right now that was following those expectations in the hallway, I probably would have to give it to first grade. So uh, it's really a, a shakeup between first grade and kindergarten. So keep up the awesome work of the primary grades. Those of you in third, fourth, and fifth, continue to follow those expectations. I know you can do it when we're walking in the hall. Do your best. Continue to practice the expectations at lunch, on the playground, wherever you are. Continue to do your best to meet those expectations that we talked about at the beginning of the year. So have my hats off to the primary grades. Keep up the hard work. Um, continue to set the example and continue to, to go throughout this week thankful for your teachers, for your friends, and thankful for your family as we prepare for next week. Today, I would like to wish Elena in kindergarten a happy birthday. If you see Elena around, be sure to wish her a happy, happy Moreland birthday. Today's lunch is the uh, crispy fish, sti fish sticks, and the alternate is the cereal um, fun lunch. Our core value this month is gratitude. Just think of the Earth's beautiful mountains and meadows, spectacular skies and serene lakes, lush forest, flowered fields, and sandy beaches. We can find plenty of stars at night and the promise of a new sunrise and sunset each day. The world needs more people to appreciate and enjoy it. That's how we can show gratitude. That's right. That's a great advice for this Tuesday morning. Just appreciating the earth, appreciating all of the beauty in our earth and taking care of our earth is a great way to show appreciation and gratitude for the things in our community. It is that time for our word of the week. It is a good one. It is a good one. A lot of people who have gratitude and are gracious and thankful are not the word of the week this week. Our word of the week this week is kind of the antonym of somebody who is gracious or gratitude. Our word of the week is a character trait. So I know some of you are talking about characters in your classroom. It is a great way to describe kind of the, the villain of your story. Um, somebody who is sneaky or the antagonist for those of you in the fifth grade. The word of the week this week is devious, devious. Devious means kind of sneaky, kind of doing something um, in a, a secretive way to get what they want. Um, kind of like setting up a trap um, and then uh, uh, trapping somebody to get what they want. Um, you know, uh, I'm thinking of Mickey Mouse Clubhouse when Pete is always like setting traps to, to um or the roads to racers, I guess is what I'm really thinking about. When Pete always sets up the traps so that the Mickey and his friends don't win the race, um, Pete would be devious. He's kind of sneaky and sly. He's always trying to cheat to get what he wants. That is what devious means. Devious, people who are devious or, or, or portray that are not very gracious or do not have a lot of gratitude. So our word of the week this week is devious. Try to find a way to say the word devious in your conversations, include it in your writing, perhaps even describe a character you're writing about in or reading about in ELA. That is it for today, ladies and gentlemen. Have a fantastic Tuesday. Work hard, show kindness and love. Don't be devious. Do the right thing, follow those expectations. And here's to an incredible day at school. Let's stand and say our Moreland mantra together. I am kind, I am capable, I am valued, we are one. Remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day, Moreland.